In this video, I want to talk about what's gone in Windows Server 2012. Now, features have been removed or deprecated in Windows Server 2012, and I want to point out some of the major changes to Server 2012 here, both for your benefit on the exam and in real life as well. Now, first of all, let's talk about these terms. When Microsoft says a feature has been removed, that means in English that has been removed. It's no longer functioning, and if you want the same functionality for whatever it was you were trying to do, you'll have to employ some alternate method. Now, when they say deprecated, that means that it's still available in this release. It's kind of a friendly reminder, kind of a little warning. Hey, this is going to go away at some point in the future, so you need to start now planning for how you're going to work around this when it finally goes away. So let's talk about, first of all, some functionalities that have been removed that you should be aware of. Some of these are kind of interesting and shocking to those of us who have been around a while. I'll leave it at that. Under networking, token ring support has been removed. That'll make you feel old. Server roles. The role collector server has been removed. Now this guy was used, I'm assuming it's a guy, to collect telemetry data. Really, that's a fancy way of saying to connect to other servers and grab all kinds of monitoring type data that we use. But now the server manager will take care of that for you. SQL Server 6.5 and earlier is no longer supported. So we're talking about 6.5, 6.0, 4.2, all those. And if you attempt to connect to a SQL Server 6.5 from Server 2012, uh, you'll just get an error message and you will not get your connection. Now also, the Storage Explorer MMC Snap-In has been removed. Once again, this functionality has been pushed into the Server Manager and its various technologies like Storage Spaces and some other things. We'll talk about that later on. Now let's turn our attention to those functionalities that have been deprecated. This one's real interesting. In Active Directory, the DC Promo Executable has been deprecated. It's going away at some future version. And if you run this right now without parameters, what we've always done to promote our domain controllers, or really to promote our member servers to domain controllers, if you do that now, you'll receive a message saying, hey, go run server manager. Okay, you can't do it this way anymore. However, if you use the slash unattend switch, it still functions just like it always did. But do understand you're losing DC Promo in the near future. Really what you're going to do now is simply add Active Directory services as a role in Server Manager. SMTP and associated management tools are deprecated. These things are still fully functional in Windows Server 2012. But Microsoft's warning you saying, hey, go ahead and make friends with system.net.smtp. Some of you developer types will recognize that as a .NET framework namespace and class, so that's more for the developer types. Other functionalities that have been deprecated here, SNMP, Simple Network Management Protocol. Here, just plan to use the common information model, CIM, in the future. This is interesting here as well. XML data reduced or XDR schema elements are going away, and you want to plan to use the W3C standard XML schema and the XSL pattern feature of MSXML3 is going away. And that's not going to make too many people sad because now they're suggesting that you use the W3C standard XPath. And XPath is very popular out there in the XML world. So there's a lot of things missing and changed in Windows Server 2012. No big deal, but you just need to be aware of them. Keep this in mind on that exam.